All right, I'm going to show you a really easy way to export your animations in Procreate with a transparent background. That way, you can layer them over top of video footage or photos or whatever. And this animation I did on a black background, but I want to make the black background disappear. I want it to be like a PNG image, but moving. I want it to be a video with a transparent background so that I can end up layering it over top of video footage. First thing you're going to do, just turn off the background color. And now if I watch the video, the exact same logo animation, but there's no background. If I go up to here and I go to share, and I look at all these different export options under share layers. So we're going to go down to these last two. I want it to be video. We're not going to do animated MP4. Now for most animations, you would want to export an animated MP4 because MP4 files are a decent quality, but still compressed and they're not too large of files. However, this last one is a new option that Procreate has added recently. It's an animated HEVC file. And when you click that, you get the option to export with a transparent background. Just click export, wait for it to export, choose where you want to save it. I'm just gonna save the video to my photos. Now I'm gonna show you real quick how I can plop that on top of video footage. And I'm gonna just do it with an iPad editing app called LumaFusion. So I have this video footage of me at the skate park. It's just for an example, I'm no pro skater. And I wanna put a logo animation right here just as I uh, zoom past the camera. So all I have to do is go up to here, click on photos, go to my videos, and you're gonna see your video file right here. Now just drag it in. I want it to be right about here and voila. You almost don't need to do a tutorial for this, it's that easy, but you don't know what you don't know. So now you know, just export as an animated HEVC file and you can throw it over top of any footage. And that's it. Let's watch it through. And there's the animation over top of my video footage. All right, let me know in the comments if anything wasn't clear or if you have any questions, or just let me know if there's something you really want to learn. If not, I'll catch you in the next video.